Hello everyone. Welcome to our new Author of the Month series, where each month we will highlight an author recommended by our librarians. This month, we're highlighting John le Carre, the master of spy novels, who died at age 89 on December 12th, 2020. John le Carre was not his real name. He was born David John Moore Cornwell in Poole, Dorset, England on October 19th, 1931. Trivia fact, his early introduction to deception came through his father, who was an abusive con man. He wrote his first three books while working as an intelligence officer for Britain's M15 and M16, England's rough equivalents to the FBI and the CIA. Trivia fact, he adopted the pen name John le Carre to get around a ban on foreign office employees publishing books under their own name. While Ian Fleming glamorized espionage in his novels, Le Carre's spies showed the dark and seedy life of the professional spy. Le Carre described his famous character, George Smiley, as the antidote to James Bond, dumpy and badly dressed. Trivia fact, Le Carre wrote The Spy Who Came In From The Cold in five weeks. This is the book that Graham Greene called the best spy story I have ever read. Mr. Le Carre refused to allow his books to be entered for literary prizes. Still, he's considered a literary giant. Trivia fact. In 2011, he was nominated for the Man Booker International Prize and asked that his name be withdrawn. Le Carre achieved international fame with his Cold War spy novels, but the end of the Cold War was not the end of his writing. New evils and themes awaited him. In all, he wrote 25 novels, one memoir, and sold more than 60 million copies of his work worldwide. His last novel, Agent Running in the Field, was published in October 2019. Trivia fact. Le Carre's A Most Wanted Man, like many of his novels, was adapted for the screen and the last feature film of Philip Seymour Hoffman. Thank you for listening. If you're interested in any of the author's books, Check our library catalog by visiting our website, www.edisonpubliclibrary.org.